Hello everybody, my name is Kill Corone, and welcome back to the channel. In this video, I'm going to talk about my new scope that I purchased, the RC6, and um, I'm going to tell you why I bought it, and if it was a mistake buying the scope, but um, let's get into that. So this is the RC6 telescope by Ioptron, this one's by I Ioptron, and um, I bought the scope because I wanted to, I, one, I wanted something for Galaxy season, two, uh, obviously the magnification, you get real close, and I can get close to the nebulae and galaxies, like all the small galaxies I've, I've seen in Stellarium, and it's pretty damn awesome. So um, that's why I got it. But um, it's also a huge like step in my astrophotography journey. Because I've never imaged with a reflector like ever I have a reflector of a 10 inch dub but I use that for observing but I've never used one for taking photos ever and I know there's a lot of maintenance that goes into these kind of scopes and I already know I signed up for that so yeah um, I've been posting this a lot on Instagram and Twitter and I've been getting mixed comments, like, oh, like, congratulations on the scope. I appreciate that, by the way. Um, I get some, like, oh, the mount, good luck with the mount. Like, it's gonna, it's not gonna hold. And I'm like, no, yeah, it is, because I know it's gonna hold, because I've looked into it, and yes, it's gonna hold. And I've seen setups way different than mine. Uh, I've seen a Rasa on the scope before, so, um, yeah, that's crazy though. A Rasa on, th on this mount is pretty intense. But um, this scope's 12 pounds. This mount can hold 22 pounds. And um, yeah, people were, some people were just like, get this, get that, why'd you get this? Why didn't you get that? Get a new mount, blah, blah, blah. And I'm like, no. Not getting a new mount, no thank you. Um, not yet. Um, they're really expensive. And this mount can hold the scope pretty well. I mean, the balance is pretty good. I've already tried to balance this mil millions of times. Uh, it might need some adjusting, obviously. But um, like with RA and deck, it does pretty well. I mean that's pretty balanced to me maybe it falls a little bit but um that's because it's not like completely balanced right now i'm still like adjusting things but right now i've got it in pretty good balance and uh obviously with cables it might that might differ so like looks fine to me maybe a little bit more adjustments obviously um i'll fine tune that balance but uh other than that it balances pretty well um yeah, so I actually tested out the scope a couple nights ago, but I didn't have the right guide scope. I was using the one for my Z61, and guiding was pretty bad, but I got the right guide scope, um, recommended by Bloodstone. So, yeah, I gotta bring the scope in soon though, it's getting the sun kind of beaming on it. But yeah, anyway, got the, got the right guide scope, and it's looking pretty good. So, I'm really excited to use the scope. Obviously, there's a lot of maintenance going, like collimation, but someone's gonna show me how to do that and I'll do it a few times. It should be a breeze, you know? But um, I'm excited to use this thing. Getting up close to those galaxies. Like, once I get this thing going, like, it's gonna be awesome. But um, obviously, there's a few things I need to fix, but we'll get to it. And it looks awesome, right? It looks pretty dang cool. Like, this setup's so cool. Got two counterweights on. I'm looking like a pro now. Not even close to a pro. I just wanted to talk about the scope. And um, yeah, was it a mistake buying it? No, no. But some of the comments did make me think, oh, like, why did I buy it? Like, to make me think that the mount is shit and all that, which is not. The mount's not poop. But the mount is good. Maybe there's some issues with the mount. Maybe you have to fine tune it a bit, but. The mount's awesome, I like this mount. It's been doing really well with my refractors, so I'm pretty happy with that. 
But, um, yeah. The comments won't stop me. <laughs> but yeah, I'm excited to use this. But anyway, I just wanted to make this really quick video. Kind of over the place, kind of like, I came outside today, I'm like, I'm just gonna make a video really quick. But, um, yeah. Uh, tell me what you guys think. Um, please don't shit on the mount. <laughs> Um, I've, I've heard enough about the mount, I get it, like, it's not like an EQ8 Pro, whatever the mount's called, freaking Skywatcher 2000, I'm sorry man. This is good, it's, it's holding well and I'm gonna take pretty cool photos with it, hopefully. So, once it's good, when I get this going, good photos. Anyway, thank you for watching, and clear skies, uh, I hope you guys are imaging, get some awesome photos. If you have the scope, let me know what you think. Um, but yeah, peace guys.